If you are a electronic hobbyist or a electronic enthusiast, you might familiar with these boards Arduino Uno, Arduino Nano, Arduino Pro Mini and Node MCU. This Arduino Uno has 6 analog inputs. This Pro Mini has 6 analog inputs and Nano has 8 inputs. Unlike other boards, this ESP8266 Node MCU has only one analog input. So, if you want to read multiple analog values for your project that working on ESP, how is that possible? Is it possible to read multiple analog values using one pin? Well, yes. So friends, in this video tutorial, I am going to show you how to read multiple analog values using only one analog pin. Let's get started. So this is how circuit diagram for demonstration I am using two variable resistors so how to read two datas from two different senses using one analog pin. You can see here I connected positive pins of variable resistor to digital pins of node MCU so we can turn on and off variable resistor by turning on and off the digital pins. Suppose we need to read the data from first analog sensor for that just turn on the digital pin in this case that is T1 at the same time we read the analog value from that sensor. Next we need to read the data of second variable resistor so now turn on the second variable resistor that is digital pin 2 and turn off the first variable resistor and we read the data from the second analog sensor. So this is the working principle. I use two diodes to avoid overlapping of data. Now let's build out circuit. First I place node MCU on breadboard. Then I soldered ground of both variable resistors to ground. Then I connected positive of variable resistors to D1 and D2. Then I attached two diodes to a zero pin. Then I connected the analog pins of variable resistors to diodes. That's all about circuit. Now I connected node MCU to computer. The coding is very simple. First I included the ESP library. Then I defined integers for pin and read value. In the setup section I defined two digital pins as output. To read first sensor value I turn on the D1 and turn off the D2 and vice versa. In the loop section I used to read value one after the other that's all. After selecting board as node MCU and correct communication board, upload the sketch. After uploading, you can see the action, everything is working. Now let's add blink app to visualize our reading. First I added blink library, blink token and also Wi-Fi credential to my program. I used virtual write function of blink app to visualize our reading. After uploading the code let's set up the blink app. Open Blink app and click on new project, add name and select board as node MCU and select two gauge buttons then select gauge button and give name and also select virtual pins for the first sensor I selected V5 and do the same for second give name and also select v6 for second pin that's all about blink up setup
now you can see the action so that's all about today hope you got some ideas about how to read multiple analog values using only one analog pin if so please like share and subscribe thanks for watching i will see you next time